Hi everybody, welcome back. In this episode I'm redoing a bit of pavement in a traditional pattern. Uh, this is next to the raised deck from a previous video in my own back garden. Uh, the reason for this old herringbone pattern is that I like to do it and it looks cool in this area. A little clean up once in a while is always nice to do and having new pavement here will sure clean up the walking area or the storing area. The old tiles are very standard and I can usually recycle them in landscaping projects as ballast or filling material. Not much material and grass needed to be removed but just enough to make place for the rim of the pavement. This goes in deeper for stability. I start with the rim in this situation because it also functions as a grade uh, level. I will reference the tiling and the sand from that. I could remove the other pavers and fill with sand then break it smooth as a, to a good surface. I will check this with a level and then start with compacting the grey. I do make sure the pebbles and rubbish gets removed because this will be easier later on with the placement. The compactor here is just a bucket of concrete with a wooden stick in it. At that point I could haul my bricks. These bricks are quite specific for this and you can even buy them used. Uh, the lifespan is decades and then they still are strong enough uh, to last in that situation. is the center line of the whole job and to check the sides how much you want to cut the bricks there. Uh, sometimes you want to start with a middle line or a middle row 
uh, to get an even cut at the sides of the whole job. The 90 degree pattern follows the line and I tap gently on the bricks. At this point the material can still sink and move as I want it to move. The edges are cut at the right angle. You do want to leave a little gap to fill with sand. Then the first layer of fill between the papers gets brushed in. And my second layer is with black sand. This looks quite cool with the red bricks and adds to the color there. And then it was finished. I hope you enjoyed this little video. 